Hello YouTube and uh, thanks for joining in. I have another open box. The uh, Amazon Echo Dot Spot Dot Spot Dot. The Amazon Echo Spot uh, open box seemed like a great success. Hopefully I answered a lot of your questions. I still use mine periodically. Um, usually when I talk to my dad from California, I live in Indiana. But um, it's a great device. I, I appreciate it and I use it. The Amazon Echo Dot, I use quite a bit. Um, my wife uses it more for cooking, and I use it a lot for music. Um, the speaker's not the best. Anyways, I'm not here for that, but um, that's in a different um, video. But today, I have a vis video on uh, fishing. I uh, moved to Indiana a year ago, and I've uh, done a lot of fishing last year. I'm going to do a lot more this year, because I'm learning more about it. Being from California, we never had the opportunity to really do any good fishing except if you're doing ocean fishing. And with that, it was basically um, drop your line and hit the bottom and pull up something that's going to be worth it. It's either going to be um, rock cod or black bass, calico bass, or uh, worst, thing, worst case scenario is um, um, a mackerel. And it's a good play, but they're not worth eating. But anyways, so being here in um, Indiana, I have a lake behind the house, and um, it's not really a huge lake. It's more of a, um, a runoff, storm runoff, and uh, but we do have fish in it. I think the depth is, uh, the middle is about three feet, and the shoreline is about two, about a foot and a half. Uh, good fishing in there. I've caught anything up to a three pound, up to a six pound bass, and I will show you a picture of that bass right here and then I've caught uh, a good size uh, bluegill uh, bluegill about the size of my palm and one even actually even nine inches long and I'll post that picture up here uh, love fishing I'm enjoying it more I'm gonna do a lot more fishing this this uh, spring if spring ever gets here it's October 14th or September, January 14th and it's starting to warm up finally but we're supposed to get snow on Tuesday next week so we'll see what happens but Anyway, I did buy something. I bought a bait cast reel. I've never used one of these before, and I was told that uh, for controlling your cast, this is the way to go. I've been using a standard reel and also a, a bell reel. And I wanted to try this because I, I thought it would be a lot more fun to um, uh, be amongst the pros and the big guys that actually use these. And I am going to do some fishing in Michigan. I'm going to do some fishing in Wisconsin and a little bit, a little bit maybe out of Illinois, not too much. But the higher up you go, you can actually get licensed for salmon. But uh, there's some great fishing up there. And I've met a couple people in my travels uh, in those two states, Michigan and Wisconsin, that they like to fish. So I'm looking forward to going with them and actually spending a couple days on a weekend and going fishing with them if they can get a charter. Charter 500 bucks for eight people. I mean, that's going to be worth it to go to Lake Michigan and do some real casting out. Um, I have a chance to go to Lake Erie also and a lot of lakes in Minnesota. Can't take my rod and reel, but I will borrow something and uh, give a catch and release if I have to. But it's about time to rip some lips. So let me show you what I got. And uh, I hope you get uh, interest on this also. And I will post everything where I bought it and how much it costs, around how much it costs. And... Uh, let me know how you like it, okay? So here we go. So I have uh, the bait cast reel that got. I bought this off of Amazon. And I think I paid $36 for it. And I didn't want to go with the standard Walmart um, reel, the, uh, reel this time. I did buy a really nice rod. I bought uh, it's a single staff for $40. And this is what it's going to go on it um it's um this time i'm going big time trying to stay up with the pros across the street we have a guy that is actually sponsored and i do want to go out with him one day anyways so uh it's a very nice color uh, i had a choice between the dark gray or the gunmetal gray or a blue one i went with the gunmetal and it's very clean it's very um quiet it's got a whole bunch of settings which i'm looking forward to trying out and, you know, some of these things I've never even seen work before because I've never been in, in, the, in the use of it. But um, 
let's see what happens when it, when I actually have a chance to use it. Um, but when I do have a chance to use it, it's going to be interesting to see how well it works and um, what happens to it. But um, other than that, I'm looking forward to actually trying this thing out. It, um, very, it's a lot smoother than a regular reel. Um, it's um, very handsome looking and I just haven't had a chance really to um, try it out at all. So we'll see what happens. Uh, I did get this from Amazon. I didn't want, like I said, I didn't want to go with the Shakespeare. This company is Sao Ai Ling. Of course, it's not from here. If it is, this guy has a hard time in school getting teased with his last name. Um, this costs $35 around there on Amazon. I will post the um, information below. So if you guys want to check it out yourself, um, this is going to be a lot of fun this year. I'm hoping to do a lot more fishing with this kind of uh, reel instead of the standard one. And uh, if I do want to uh, do any any fishing in Minnesota whenever I go, I will have the company of my mini pole. And um, I can actually go fishing with this. And uh, if it ever works out that I uh, catch anything with this, I will post it. That's a joke. I'm not going to use this. It was kind of funny. I thought I got it as a joke. And um, it's <laughs> kind of crazy how um, how, much you, how much you could spend on a joke. But um, <laughs> actually, it does work. Um, it's a total of three feet long from end to end. And uh, when you're done with it, you can actually collapse it all the way down and uh, store it in your pocket if you want to. But I thought about this as a joke, and and uh, I think I spent like 12 bucks on this thing. But, you know, it's always worth a joke. So anyways, um, but again, when it comes to something new, I'm looking forward to trying this out. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, I appreciate uh, your input. Um... Yeah, I ask you please to like, share, and uh, post this um, with friends. Uh, I, I need all the information I can get on um, how to use this better. Everything I do catch with it, I will post a picture and what I use to catch it. Uh, I'm hoping to catch uh, some nice size. I have a couple more lakes that I can actually go to this year that are close by. So, thanks again for your time. Um, if you have any questions, again, please, by all means, ask my questions. If you have any questions about the Amazon Echo and the Echo Spot and uh, the Dot, uh, by all means, ask me that, too. I do love that item. Um, I even bought the Fire Tablet 7-inch that I take on my trips for videos, and I can watch movies on this, and I can hold quite a bit of movies with that. Um, and I have information on that, too. I got it for $29 as a refurbished, and it's, it's a great little carrying pocket uh, little uh, movie theater so anyways thank you very much i appreciate your time and uh, uh let's go fishing thanks guys no, no.